Well, we're getting ready for Halloween, so beware. Beware the threshold. The star. Uh, I forget the name of this. The was uh, Idaho and the company. Hi guys. And they throw away to the garbage. So I'm rescued. And there wasn't a five gallon pot. Now it's in a two gallon pot. I reduce the uh, roots. So I'm becoming a strong. So would you call this a bonsai? Yep. Bonsai is the art. Well, uh, I saw you pruning it just now. That that was the art right there. You were just kind of snipping here and there. Yeah. This is a long process to learning and bonsai. You need know when and how to not disturb the roots. And uh, our combination or the soil before on the top here is a red lava. But on the bottom we have panos in cactus mix with lava. So they wow. can make it like big, big, nice, healthy roots. Look, look how well these are doing. The tomatoes are doing well. Yep, tomatoes are doing well. I think you have a watermelon back there somewhere, don't you? Yep, we have two watermelons. We have banana leaf. Oh, wow. This yeah. is banana. This is a kind of door banana doing in the Bay Area. That's good. We have pink lemonade. Regular lemonade called O'Neill. And we have more tomatoes from the neighbors. And we're just transplanting some Myers lemons here. They are rough from sea. Wow, it's beautiful. Now talking about bonsais, look at all these bonsais here. Give well, you an idea of the scale here with my hand. Yep, this is the new one. Believe it or not, three of these trees, they be, become uh, rescue trees. Oh. From the garbage. And we save, except for this one. But all these trees, they have been saved for the garbage. Wow. So well, they're, they're doing very well, you've saved them. Yeah. So this one, it's doing very well. This one, well too. <clears throat> they're gorgeous. Yeah. Um, this one is from uh, parts of the circulants. So they start coming with new babies. Hey, Jan. All this one is a part yeah. circulants. Oh, my favorite called donkey ears. Oh, donkey ears succulent. Yep, yeah, donkey look at that. ears. And when we start seeing it, they have like a bunch of new babies coming out. <laughs> for one leaf. Well, well done, Arturo. Well done. See that? See that? They're not burning. Oh, okay. Are they cooking though? Of course. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> They're not I cooking. So. They're pretty so much I, done. I should, I should get some butter off them. I should get some butter. Yeah. Yes. I have, yeah. I have milk, uh, Nick made some uh, garlic butter oh, okay. for anybody who wants it. So we soak this overnight, Steve. Yeah. So that see that so that we get that kind of result because we want we want the shell, we want the skins, the wrap. Burn a little bit, it'll give it a different flavor. And the other thing that's going to happen is that because we're cooking this, it's going to uh, the grill is going to take a little bit of the corn flavor. And then when we grill the steaks, the steaks are going to take a little bit of that corn flavor. Okay, and New, then New York steaks, you know, yeah, we made uh, the pork ribs underneath to heat it up nicer. So, just about done, right? They are done. All right, corn is done. Uh, I yeah. think that's going to be a hit tonight, one. Yeah, a nice little roast. Nice little roast. You know, some of the important things in a barbecue is like having some good corn. Look at that. Oh, not, it's beautiful. None of them are pop. That's... Yeah. Pop, popcorn. Popcorn. That's expecting popcorn. So these have been done with a nice marinating uh, that Juan's got a certain way of doing it and they actually look aged. These are New York steaks. 
So what do you think? We didn't, uh, this time we didn't get ribeyes, so do you think these are going to be good? They are, because what we're going to do, you see this nice layer of fat? We're going to start by cooking them on the fat, so that what we want to do is we want to char the fat, and then you take care of the rest. Can I get my So that was Zonia, she wants hers well done, but then Kenny, that's Kenny and Zonia, Kenny likes his almost like it's uh, ready to moo and all this kind of stuff. So we got a different uh, choice there of uh, the way steaks are liked. So this is uh, good for sealing in and, and uh, getting the, the nice uh, outside uh, kind of like, are you trying to, to, uh, to seal it, char it? Yeah, well, I'm trying to, uh, to seal it. And the way to seal it is you go really high heat and that preserves the flavor inside the steak. Okay. And that's when you can go, you know, bloody, you can go rare, and it doesn't take away from the steak. So for all you steak lovers out there, you know, there are certain ways to do steaks, and uh, a, lot, a lot of people have experience uh, doing these more than I, and Juan's a great uh, steak cooker. Preparing steaks is uh, a forte of his. Uh, so a lot to, to be learned from uh, watching a uh, master at work here. Okay, so we got high heat and uh, the, the back burner is also on. So he's gonna cook these on the fat. Do you find more of a challenge when there are a lot of steaks to do? No, it's actually less because see, I can I can pile them this way. Okay. Yeah, I guess so. If you only had like two or three, it'd be harder to do. Then you can't really stand them up. This way, you can lean them against each other. All right. Prepare for an assault on the senses. So, how long do uh, do you cook the uh, fat? Uh, I'm probably gonna do about five minutes. Okay. Now, when we open this, be careful because there's gonna be huge flames. Hmm. Ready to watch? So here we go. One, two, three. Whoa, look at that. That's what you call cooking the fat. That's right. I don't know about you, Juan, but that's hot in there. <laughs> oh, that's the whole idea, Steve. So now you're flattening them out. Yep. Would you like some gloves? You know, it's like Daniel in the furnace. Yeah. Shadrach, Besatch, and Abednego. <laughs> the furnace was so hot that the uh, people that were opening the, uh, the, the door, they died immediately. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Steve, you got a new camera? Uh, this is actually a new one. You, you haven't seen this one. Yeah, nobody you got the iPad. Well, Kenny, this this uh, camera is like uh, you know mirrorless. Yep. So I had to I had to join the uh, you know get up to date. <laughs> you got to get up to date. Oh, well done, one. I mean, you don't want them that way, but <laughs> that was... wow, look at this. Yep. Now the beauty of these is that the insides actually have a nice pinkness and uh, the tenderness. Oh, is, is that one Zonia's? Zonia's gonna have like, well done. Yeah. Oh my God. So, so one, which one's Zonia's? It's in here already. Ah, okay. It's pretty blackened. Yeah, Zonia got the uh, blackened one. The black one. The <laughs> 
The charcoalized. Charcoalized. Beautiful. Now look at those grill marks. Those so right grill here, marks on those. Yeah, New York steaks. Formerly known as New York steaks. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Are you recording a video for YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's made, it's, uh, I mean, I, 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 made I with spinach you know, and like feta cheese. Oh boy. <laughs> and filo dough. Yeah. It's really savory. <laughs> <laughs> And here we have ribs. Nothing like pork ribs. Yes. They're so tasty. Nicely barbecued. And then we have here a home, salad? yeah, made from scratch. Potato salad's got all, all kinds of goodness in there. So it's not your regular potato salad. It's got all kinds of mixtures in there. And then we have the New York steaks and a nice baby spinach salad along with vinaigrettes and all kinds of other dressings churro? chimichurro and so this one's one's concoction yeah. and another one are they different yeah they're okay. a little different oh. and then this one's nix oh. so what do you think that one's um, uh, a little bit hotter. This one's a little bit milder. They're both very good. Um, let me taste the last one and tell you what that one is. This is really good bread. This is cranberry bread from Costco, if you can believe. Uh -huh. Not from Semi Freddy's like I thought it was. Nix is like Adventureland. They're all very good. This one's got a nice kick to it too. It's got a nice little spicy kick to it. This one's milder. That one's a little bit hotter. That one has an aftertaste to it. A little dead. I find that I like all three. Mm -hmm. okay. So what we have here is a pomegranate Cosmo. So Carl Ann, go ahead and tell us about that. So um, Nick made this for us. It's vodka. Contra and pomegranate juice, which I asked for rather than the normal is cranberry juice And the reason why I asked for it is for fall equinox uh, I looked up what kinds of foods do you serve for fall equinox and pomegranate seeds are significant because Persephone when Hades took her she was not to eat or drink anything and she was so proud of herself that she only ate six pomegranate seeds and that meant for six months of the year she has to go back to Hades and stay with him and her mother was so upset by this every year for six months she covers everything in snow Wow great so, but how's the uh, pomegranate Cosmo? Um, I asked for a little bit more pomegranate because I'm a sweet fan. I'm not necessarily an alcohol fan. So Nick put an extra splash of pomegranate juice in it for me, and it's quite good. <laughs> Great. I'm going to have one of those right now. Yeah. <laughs> what are we cooking now, Juan? I'm grilling some pineapple, but what happens is I cut a piece too thick. Oh. So you see that? Yeah. There's no movement, right? Yeah. See that? Yeah, it's, it's flopping. So that's what we want. We want floppiness. If we don't have floppiness, you close the lid. Well, all the frivolity and the, the wonderful conversation calms down and goes away when the camera gets turned on. Not at all. <laughs> You don't think so? Oh no no oh, no yeah. no no! Oh yeah! Well, this big boy is gonna no. This big boy is gonna cook. <laughs> no 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 no! <laughs> well, there's oh, the yes, whole yes. spread. I was just joking. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Oh my God! And all the plates and all the settings are all ready to go. I think it's time to dive in and eat. Yep. 
No, that's a Valeria, not a wife. Isn't that enough? Oh, yeah, yeah. Hey, no, I hear that. You never get it. And then with that. He said, we got to come now. Oh my God. <laughs> well, as usual. Calm down, Penny. What do you know about that story? Calm down. I'll take her home, Kenny. You go home by yourself. <laughs> There's one in the corner. We're going to bring it. Yeah, she's pretty yummy. Okay, go ahead. She knows already. Uh -huh. One, two, three, four. He's sitting there. Okay, I'll move over. I can sit here. Stay. Come, right? Just like yeah. All right. So I should bring out the the steaks. I season them same way I season this ones. She goes in and she brings it up the the water, and then I make the steak. And she goes and hides. She hides behind the counter outside, and you see the plate. And the inside is still moist. Mm -hmm. nice to know. Nice. Really I'm learning tonight. Yeah. But the funny thing is, like, at the end of it, she was happy to see us still. <laughs> she was like, sorry, we closed. Oh. <laughs> so. And this is the essence of the steak that's so tasty, is that the center is nice and tasty, and tender, <laughs> and scrumptious. <laughs> and everybody's being quiet now because just because the camera's running. Isn't it terrible? To go on video people. Honey, tell us what happened. <laughs> She's like, what's the what word is? Talk today? about Karen. Oh well, yeah, I met a Karen in Puerto Morelos. Oh, I was one? just filming the food and the pretty decorations. Mm -hmm. I wasn't uh, even saying anything. Came up. <laughs> Talk about yeah, about himself. Is, is, is after they cracked my chest? Yeah. I got one boob that's so higher than the other. <laughs> Remember like in Saturday Night Live? Never knew until I told him. It's like him, you said, get them to go hey. up and down. <laughs> <laughs> so now you know how women feel. <laughs> Being objectified in every day. <laughs> the, the ribs were good. Well, you gotta say it all together. Happy all, right. all, all together. Halloween. All together. Equinox. We'll Put have on the a shirt. Halloween dinner. Halloween's another thing. Put on the okay. Come on. Happy Halloween. You already Happy showed Halloween. the video. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. Well, all, you have to say all, one, two, three. All, all, together. Okay. all together, people. One, two, three. Happy Halloween.